Temperatures above normal again uh, today. Uh, we are at our low temperature for the day, 41 degrees and a high of 47. That was shortly after midnight this morning. Most spots uh, staying in the mid 40s uh, for a big part of the day. Now tonight, temperatures for your location not falling too fast. A big part of the area in the 40s here across eastern Ohio and western Pennsylvania. 41 in Mercer, 41 in Austin Town, and 42 in Lisbon. I'm only expecting these temperatures to dip into the upper 30s by tomorrow morning, and that's good news because there's some drizzle around. If we were below freezing, I'd be a little more concerned about that drizzle overnight, but not the case tonight. Lots of clouds, a few holes trying to open up, but they are struggling. Uh, tomorrow, that won't be the case, though. We're going to see more sun working its way out. That chance of drizzle uh, staying in my forecast at least until early tomorrow morning, and then better weather moving in. This clearing line to our south has been taken its time, but it is lifting north through southern Ohio. So by tomorrow afternoon, uh, looking for quite a bit of sunshine, and that's going to help boost those temperatures uh, back up into the mid 50s. Here's future tracker through morning. Lots of clouds, pockets of drizzle for us. Uh, temperatures to start the day in the upper 30s to around 40 degrees, and then uh, clouds move out as we go into mid to late morning into the afternoon. Those temperatures uh, climbing on up in that sunshine uh, back to the mid to lower 50s uh, to wrap up your Wednesday. So nice weather around uh, as we approach the middle part of the week. Thursday morning, here comes the showers again. The next storm system sweeping on through. Temperatures will stay mild and the chance of showers sticking around especially Thursday morning. The storm system is trying to slip a little more off to the southeast. That's good news for us taking that heaviest rain away from here. And it looks like the bulk of this rain will be pushing out by Thursday afternoon. And that opens the door for that cold air to start pouring in. And that cold air across Lake Erie going to cause some trouble in the snowfall department as we go through a late week and into the weekend. But the main threat uh, through the northern snow belt, Ashtabula, Crawford counties up toward I-90. This is where the heaviest snow is going to fall. Just a few flurries or snow showers on to the south. So looking into the weekend, talking about snow, I'm talking about that primary snow belt, and that is Geauga County, Ashtabula County, and Crawford County just clipping northern Trumbull and Mercer counties because that wind off of Lake Erie will be out of the west, uh, keeping those snow bands off to the north. So uh, that's a better news if you live further south, if you didn't want the snow, of course. 38 tonight, mostly cloudy, uh, drizzle around through first thing tomorrow morning. Uh, temperatures tomorrow in the mid 50s, partly sunny skies expected after we get through that morning clouds uh, around the area and of course that chance of drizzle. Here's your seven day forecast and it looks like a cold snap late week won't last long. 48 on Thursday, scattered showers, 34 cooler Friday. Chance of snow showers or flurries, especially through the snow belt. Friday night into Saturday, some of those snow showers could sneak farther south, but it won't last long. That wind shifts right back around to the west. Uh, so watching that storm system closely early weekend. It's going to be cold Saturday, though. Highs in the low 30s. Coldest day we've had around here in some time. Sunday warms right back up to 40. 48 Monday, 54 Tuesday. And it looks like it's going to stay warm through a big part of our Christmas week. Hmm. Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> More of the same. Right. Yeah.